Music, and we are going to talk today about Bob Marley, who um, February is Black History Month, and they might you might be featuring other um, different other people during other classes. And we take some time to, I, at least in my music classes, we take some time at least every year to talk about one or two different Black musicians that have had an influence in American music. And Bob Marley is one of these guys. Um, you've probably heard a lot of his music, but you may not have known it was necessarily his. He kind of um, he kind of brought reggae music to America and made it familiar to us. It's kind of, you think of tropical music, you think of maybe some of those steel pipe, um, some of those steel pipe drums, steel drums that you see um, on, if you ever go to a tropical, uh, if you see a tropical movie or, or you ever go to a tropical vacation and you see steel drums being played in the side of the, um, the, the side of the street, maybe for donations and stuff. Um, it's very peppy, it's syncopated, it's kind of, um, um, it's laid back, but it's peppy at the same time, if that makes sense. And Bob Marley is someone who is not living anymore. He died when he was about 37 when he of skin cancer. So it would be interesting to see what, his life, what the world would be like today if he was still alive, because he was a very, very good musician, very popular. He was born in Jamaica. And that was back when Jamaica was run by the United Kingdom or England. And um, there was extreme wealth in Jamaica and there was extreme poverty in Jamaica. If you were a white person and you were British and you were living over there, you were probably a leader or in charge of something in the, in the island of Jamaica. And you were probably very, very wealthy. Everybody else was probably very, very poor. And that was the case with Bob Marley. His mom was 18 years old and she worked on a plantation they weren't, there wasn't slavery back then, but black people were the workers and white people were the foremen. And uh, there was quite a bit of difference in their income. She was 18. She had a baby with um, a black British, or I'm sorry, a white British guy who was 47. So there's quite a bit of difference in their age. And the dad really wasn't involved in his life um, after Bob was born. And so his mom was a very big, big influence in his life. He also um, st became interested in the religion Rastafaria, which is kind of a Middle Eastern religion. Uh, they call them they call themselves Rasta, and Rasta is um, probably kind of the god that they worship. And um, he was very much he talked about that a lot in his music. He talked about that a lot when he, in his concerts, and he did a lot for the world. He didn't just sit around and make a lot of money. He remembered how poor he was, and he actually um, spent. He came to America for for a few years because there was. Um, there was an assassination attempt on his life because two British people were in charge of, they were running for political office. And he didn't want to get in the middle of, of he didn't want to be side, side with either, either political person, but one of those political people who was running for office um, scheduled a great big rally right after one of his concerts. And so he kind of ended up getting in the middle of this and someone attempted to take his life and, and shoot him um, in a car and, um, and his, wife actually was was one of the people that got shot he got shot and almost died but his wife also got shot he lived um and then spent some time in in america for um quite a few years after that but he he took time to go around the world and to try and make the world a better place and he spent a lot of time in africa where people were um, a lot of black people were treated unfairly again and he was trying to make their life better and he was trying to rally them and give them some hope so i would like you to Look at the video link that I put underneath the, the lesson plan. It's only six, about six minutes and 50 seconds or something. Um, it, it, it's a big um, review of his life. Not that long, but I'd like you to write down eight things that you learned about his life. And also three um, links to songs on YouTube that are from him. 
that you might you might recognize. It's kind of interesting. A very interesting person. And um, he has made an influence on American music. So um, have fun learning about the life of Bob Marley. And I'm anxious to see your paper when you turn it back in. Thanks.